Hello, it's Lolly. Welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you my hair care routine. If you want to know how I maintain my colored hair, please keep on watching. So guys, before we jump into the video, if you like my content, don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below. Also, click the bell button beside it so you'll get notified whenever I upload a new video. So as I said a while ago, I'm going to be sharing with you my hair care routine since as you can see, my hair is really, really treated. I recently had my hair dyed again. So it was previously bleached. Kaya sobra sobra ng damage na talaga ng buhok ko. And for my hair condition, my roots get easily oily, and my ends and the middle part of my hair is dry. All right, so let's start. If your hair is colored or bleached, do not wash your hair every day. So I'm saying this one para ma maintain nyo yung color ng hair nyo and mas mapatagal nyo pa siya. Wag nyo siyang laging laging shampoo. If you can do it every two days, that's better. So whenever I don't wash my hair, what I use is a dry shampoo. Tapos nilalagay ko lang siya sa aking scalp para yun yung parang sumisip sip ng oil ng hair ko para hindi siya maging greasy throughout the day. If you could do it every other day, then that's good. But pag hindi talaga kaya, and if you need to wash your hair every day, do not use shampoo every day. Use conditioner lang. You'll know it's time for you to use a shampoo kapag yung roots nyo is really greasy already or oily. So if that time comes, it's time for you to use a shampoo again. So what I'm going to be sharing with you today is my hair care routine whenever I do shampoo my hair. Step 1, shampoo your roots only. So what I do is I dilute the shampoo on my palm. Tapos you massage your scalp with the shampoo. So, bakit sa scalp lang? Kasi ang shampoo kasi ay nakaka-dry siya ng buhok nyo. So, kapag nilagay nyo siya hanggang sa end, mas magiging dry lang yung mga parts na na-bleach sa inyo or na-treat na buhok. Step 2, condition your middle part until the end. So, what I do is I apply the conditioner sa aking ends going up papunta sa middle part. And kapag konti na lang, tsaka ko lang siya pinapaabot so may bandang top part but not on my roots. The reason why you don't want to add conditioner sa inyong scalp is because it will just create oil and mas magiging greasy kagad ang inyong hair. Step 3 is you towel dry your hair by squeezing the excess water and not rubbing it. The reason why you don't want to rub your hair is because you're going to create friction. And when there's friction, there's frizziness. Step 4, apply a hair serum on the ends until the middle part of your hair. So this serum is for uh, moisture and it will lessen the cause of frizziness. Last step is use a wide toothed comb in combing your hair para rin ma-avoid yung friction sa inyong buhok and kapag natuyo siya, hindi masasira yung natural wave ng hair nyo or if straight man siya, hindi siya magkukos ng print. So that's it for this video. I hope you like it and I hope that you learned a lot from the way I take care of my hair. And if you have any questions or suggestions, just leave it in the comment box below and I'll see you next time. Don't forget, smile! There's always a reason to be happy. Bye!